Yo, what's up, y'all? It's your boy Reefy here. Now, before we get into this video, can I ask that y'all do me some favors? First, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on post notifications as well. Also, follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and Instagram as well. On Twitch, I got some sub badges and sub emotes y'all could use if y'all subscribe. And yeah, it really truly does mean a lot that y'all subscribing and supporting the channel in any way, shape, or form. It really truly does mean a lot. And with that done, we're gonna get on with the video. Yo, what's up, y'all? It's your boy Reefy here in the back of part 24 of Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix on Critical Mode. So in the last video, right? We finished the Port Royal where we fought that annoying ass boss and I died so many times, right? So with that boss being beaten, we don't gotta worry about the Aztec Gold no more. Also, we went back to Atlantica where we fought Ursula and beat her. And I thought that was the last time we got to visit Atlantica, but nope, we gotta visit it one more time, I believe. So after we visited Atlantica and did that little Ursula battle, we came here back to Agrabah and we found out that Jafar was released from his lamp by the stupid peddler. So yeah, with that being done, we're going to go on about this little adventure. So let's get out of here. Okay, where do we got to go? Uh, Let me look at the journal, see where we got to go. We got to follow Iago. I think we have to go to the Cave of Wonders, if I remember correctly. But yeah, let me take care of this uh, large body heartless. I don't think that's his name, but yeah, let's- Wait, what? I die? Are you serious, bro? Really? Oh no, we gotta go. We gotta go to the desert. That's right. I, wow. I, I had a feeling we had to go to the desert, but yeah, let's head on over to the desert. And this fucking capture card, bro. It's fucking capture card, bro. Shit is getting on my nerves now, bro. Yo, like I really don't know if it's OBS or my capture card itself, cause um I was streaming like right before I, was, I started recording this, and my capture card didn't do this. Am I really about to die again? But yeah, I, like I don't know, bro. Like I really hope it's not my capture cards. I'm not. I'm not trying to buy another Elgato capture card. These Elgato capture cards really are not cheap at all. I paid like 160 something dollars for my Elgato. Yo, you're not dead ass right now, bro. You are not dead ass right now, bro. You're, yo. You know, let me rest Donald. There we go. Yeah, I think we gotta go outside the palace. Well, yeah, we do. We're just gonna have to turn back. There's gotta be a way. Ah, oh, come on, kid. That's an easy one. Ow, oh, buddy, oh, pal. This is what having a genie for a best friend is all about. I mean, how can you leave me on the sidelines at a time like this? Lift large. Wow, Mel. It's the old Rasmataz. What do you say, kid? Hey, genie. Sora. Want to see a little something I call Sandstorm Sweep? Oh, wow. Take it away, Genie. I like a sand. Uh, you know, one lousy sandstorm is just too easy. Giving me a challenge next time, AL. All right, so thanks to Genie, we can finally go um to that place you gotta go. So let me just save the game real quick and heal everybody up. So yeah, I'm gonna save the game. Okay, with the game saved, let's head on over to the um the Cave of Wonders. Okay, so now we hear the Cave of Wonders. Let's see what. Okay, we got these Ice Cube Heartless. Yo, that reminds me of that Pokemon from Pokemon Sword and Shield. The um. The penguin with the ice cube on his head? I think it's called like Ice Cube. Very creative name, I know. But yeah. That's what that Ice Cube Heartless reminds me of. Wait, so go to the... De yo, yo, I've always had trouble figuring out where to go for this world, bro. I don't know why. Like, I don't even think I'm supposed to be at the Cave of Wonders, honestly. Wait, I'm supposed to go this way. I went the wrong way like an idiot. But yeah, I don't know why I always get so lost and confused for this world. Now what do we do? Nice timing, Carpet! Yo, 
Yo, I've always loved this part of the Agrabah, bro. This has always been my favorite, favorite part of the game. But yeah, we gotta follow Jafar's shadow by riding the carpet. So yeah, let's follow- oh. Nah, seriously though, I don't know what it is. I've always loved this part. But yeah, now you gotta defeat all the Heartless. I think- oh no, there isn't a time limit. But yeah. Um, yeah, so we just gotta defeat the Heartless, follow Jafar's shadow, and ride on the carpet. Pause? I guess? That sounded kind of weird. Okay, that's all of them. Yo, like, I really don't know what it is. Like, this part is just so fire. Like, I mean, Carpet is kind of annoying to control because, like, he turns, it turns like a tank. But Jafar's casting spells, you gotta stop him. Okay, there we go. J if you want to stop him from casting spells, just hit him. Attack him. Okay, now I'm not liking this part as much as, as much as I said I did. Like, because th this carpet control is really weird. All right, let's stop him from... Okay, there we go. Okay, looks like we got to chase his shadow once again to that building over there that looks very specific and out there. Definitely doesn't look like it has any sort of importance or significance tomorrow, right? Is that all of them? I think that's all of them. I hope it's all of them. Yeah, yup, it's on top of the building. Okay, now we gotta defeat all the Heartless again. Wow, this part sucks. And what, I said I like this part? Nah, this shit is whack. I guess as I'm older now and I'm realizing the flaws with it. Like that's the, that's the beauty with a lot of... Well, I don't know if I call it beauty, but like... That's really crazy how a lot of things you, you liked as a kid, when you're older... And a lot wiser and smarter, you hate them. Or not hate them, but you see the flaws in them and you realize that, hey, this isn't as good as I once thought it was. Like, honestly, that's how I feel when I, like, play my GameCube and Wii games. Like, I don't get me wrong, I still love them. Because, like, they're still fun to me and because they gave me mad good memories. You feel me? But, like, playing, like, my Wii and GameCube games as an adult, I'm just, like, these games aren't as good as they used to be. Well, they, like I said, they're still good, but, like, I just don't get the same enjoyment out of them as... Because I'm... at Because I'm... Since I'm an adult now, you know? Like, the, like, one time I played Super Smash Brothers Bro uh, Melee, right? And I was just like, wow, this game is... I mean, the game is still fun, don't get me wrong, but I'm just like, wow, this game just, just doesn't excite me like it used to, you know? Okay, examine the monument. Okay, you gotta examine, like, three of these and find those, um... And it, Sorry, so here's... A, when you examine the monument, it gives you a picture... And that picture's a hint to those to where those little egg-shaped things are. So yeah, we just gotta go around the area and find them. So yeah, the first one is under that little bridge area right here. So we're gonna go under the bridge area and find it. And you may notice it's different colors. That's because it's the colors represent a different type of magic. Red is fire, blue is blizzard, and uh yellow is thunder. So whatever color it is, you gotta hit it with that magic spell. So yeah, see these little egg looking things right here? Use magic to trigger the switch. So C is red, so we gotta use fire. Alright, there we go. So we gotta find the other two switches now. Okay, so this one is gonna be... Using magic... Eh. Okay, wait. Okay, okay. So when it gets to that position, we gotta use thunder on it. So I fucked up. Wow. Alright, so once it turns all yellow, we gotta use thunder on it. Like that. God, this heartless is getting in the way. Okay, there we go. Alright, what magic is it gonna be? Is it gonna be blizzard? Yep, it's Blizzard, but I can't use it just... Okay, now I can use Blizzard. There we go. Wait, I just did it. Are you fucking serious? Wait, no. I'm use I'm picking fire like an idiot. I'm so dumb. Okay, th Wait, no. I gotta hit him all at once. I gotta position myself right. There we go. There we go. We trigger all the switches. Okay, with that unlocked, we gotta hurry to the tower before the door closes. You have plenty of- you have plenty of time. You have more than enough time, honestly. Like, if you don't get to the tower in time, then- Okay, so here we are in the ruined chamber at Agaba. Let's open this treasure chest to see what we got in here. A map. Who would've guessed? You know what? I'm gonna save the game real quick so I don't die in case anything happens. Okay, there we go. What's in this treasure chest? I think it's the last torn page. Yup, I was right, the last torn page. So once you complete Agaba, we're gonna go back to Pooh's storybook and complete the 100 acre wood. The game's up, Jafar!
You sure this is it? Yeah, yeah. You gotta understand, it wasn't my idea. It was your father. He made me bring you here. You don't know him like I do. He can be very convincing. He said if I didn't cooperate, he was gonna... Where is he? Come on, Al, you gotta forgive me. Where's Jafar? Well, uh, let's see. Right about now, he's probably attacking the palace. I had no choice. His eyes, they got all creepy and weird. Whatever. Iago, you're supposed to be our friend. But you've been playing both sides just to make sure you save yourself. I knew you were still a bad guy. I'm sorry! Okay, so now we got to escape from the ruins. Now, this part right here, I think I'll still like. But um, I can't blame them for being pissed at Iago. Because, like, you you, you was cap and saying you was their friend. You turned over a new feather and all that. And it's like, bro, you lied to save your own ass. But then again, I, I feel like this is kind of like the glasses have full glasses have empty type of thing. Where it's like, Jafar pretty much threatened to kill Iago if had Iago not have done his bidding. So... <laughs> but like then again, it's like Iago could have tricked Jafar into thinking that he was still on his side. But yeah, I don't blame him for being pissed at Iago. But yeah, let's escape this temple before something before bad things happen. But yeah, I said that after I'm done with this world, we're gonna go back to the Hundred Acre Wood, and then afterwards we're gonna go back to the Pride Lands. I mean, not Pride Lands, to Halloween Town. Then Pride Lands. Then um, what you call it? Then then Space Paranoids, and then we're pretty much at end game like we're really we're getting close to we're getting close to the end of the game i'll say maybe about like six more videos and i'll be done with this and this and this playthrough will be over with i can't say for sure but yeah i might do extra videos where i do like the mushroom 13 do the data battles fight the absent silhouettes or i'll do the tournaments but yeah like to do all that i'm gonna have to gr i'm gonna have to grind for wait I, I can't heal myself are you serious i can't use cure why not Bro, this got to be a joke or something, bro. I cannot cure myself. Bro, this shit this shit is not real life right now. Wait, I think that's the end of it. Oh, that was the end of it anyway. But yeah, I might do extra videos, so yeah. But yeah, I'd have to do a lot of grinding. Plus, I might get the Ultima weapon. Get some rest, Carpet. You earned it. Let's get Jafar! And who asked you? The palace is through there. Hurry! Okay, so now with my health really low, I'm gonna save the game and heal myself and then go to the palace and put Jafar on a t-shirt. But like a lot of the things I said I was gonna do in the extra videos, I've never done them before. Like I've never gotten through the Cavern of Remembrance. I've never like completed the tournaments and stuff in the in the Olympus Coliseum. So like this is a like this is a first for me like playing the game on critical mode and actually beating it that would be a first for me like i said i, I always play on normal mode because i've always been scared of critical mode but yeah like if i beat this game on critical mode i'll be so proud of myself like i'm telling my friends who love kingdom hearts that i beat this game on critical mode for the first time just wait jafar you'll get exactly what's coming to you indeed i will princess all of Agrabah will belong to me, while you... <laughs> you, my queen, shall weep at my side for all eternity. Oh, please. Uh, right about now, your precious Aladdin is whispering your name with his last breath. <gasps> hmm? What was that you were saying, Jafar? You dare defy me, you useless bird! <gasps> Ow! Iago! You'll all be joining him very soon.
And here it is. We got to fight Jafar. Yo, I don't know why, but for some reason, he reminds me of him from the Powerpuff Girls. I guess because they're both red and creepy looking. Yo, him used to scare the crap out of me when I was a kid. But yeah, his weak point, like I was saying, his weak point is his abdomen. Once you get this health down right here, you got to hit him in his head. Pause. But yeah. Oh, wait, no, you got to roll him up like a spliff. You feel me? But yeah, and spin him around. And now he's stunned, and you just gotta keep attacking him. So yeah, just hit him on the head, and yeah. Yo, I swear this game is every button mash's wet dream. Okay, yeah, he does this too, where he stuns you. Yeah, so let's attack him in his abdomen again. Oh, this boss fight is going way better than I thought it would, not gonna lie. Oh, no, 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 for this for this game because yo the final boss has like five different phases to it and like if i remember correctly if you die on one you have to start the whole whole thing over except for the last phase i think but yeah i'm really not looking forward to it because that final boss is going to be a pain in the ass bro oh yeah also there's one secret boss i want to fight but those who know i'm talking about the lingering will the lingering will is one of the hardest bosses in video game history bro like no funny shit i'm not exaggerating when i say that boss is really difficult like if you think sephiroth is difficult the lingering will is probably worse bro no i'm going to die i'm going to die i'm going to die i'm going to die you're goddamn right okay there we go all right i'm about to beat him yo i really thought i was gonna die right there i was gonna be so tight if i died okay just a few more hits okay a few more hits and Jafar is done. And I got the um next fire spell, Fire Raga. Yeah, Fire Raga. So yeah, Jafar's dead. No! Who oh, can I be defeated again by a pack of filthy street rats? Don't mess with street rats. You went mano a mano with Jafar and you didn't invite me, Al? Sorry, Genie. Things happen kind of fast. And I had some new moves to show off, too. Now, Genie, you still need your help. Who's gonna fix Agraba? Oh, yeah! Well, Super Duper spruced up Agraba coming right up. You won't even recognize the place when I'm through with it. Just like it was, please. Really? Same old, same old. All right. Voila! Next time, let me put in a few swimming pools, okay? And with that done, we got the wishing lamp. Wishes come true by increasing the drop rate of money and HP and MP orbs. Pretty good keyblade if I do say so myself, but I kind of like the design of it too, but yeah, we got the wishing lamp. <sighs> I guess Agrabah's all right now. Yeah, thanks, guys. Hey, you behave yourself. Got it? I most definitely got it. No more looking out for number one. I'm reformed. I want to be a good friend like Genie, but I can't do anything to help you. What kind of a friend is that? Oh, no. It's not like that, Iago. Friends don't have to do stuff. As long as you have fun hanging out together, that's all that matters. So, what do you guys do for fun? Uh, that's not quite what I meant. Well, anyway... Ow, oh, my feet! Gorsh, Iago. I hope you didn't hurt yourself. Well, <coughs> at least I can still fly. Whoa! Whoa, oh, oh, whoa! Oh. Is that my cue? Am I on? Come on, Al! Let me build a freeway or something! 
Uh, everything's fine. Don't panic. Genie? But I can't hold it any longer! Yeah! Hey, hey. <laughs> oh, that's good! <laughs> Sora, Donald, Goofy, you guys are too much. If you're ever in the mood for some more cosmic razzle dazzle, give me a shout, okay? Well, you've done it again, Sora. Don't forget about us, okay? I won't. And Sora, about that friend of yours, the one you're looking for, you'll find him. Trust me. And with that done, we finished Agaba. We don't got to worry about Jafar, the lamp, or any of that no more. So with that done, we got two, no, three more Disney worlds to go. Well, four, technically speaking. So like I said, with the last torn page in our hands, we're going to go back to Pooh's storybook, the 100 Acre Wood. So yeah, let's head over there right now. I really can't believe it. This is the last torn page, man. And I can't believe we're reaching endgame. 24 parts and we're almost at the end of the game, man. I really can't believe it. it's really been a great journey like you know actually let me save all the sentimental stuff for when i finish the game so yeah let's go to the 100 acre wood and see what's up oh bother oh Pooh got his head stuck in the honey jar somehow sorry is that you help all right let's do the the good person thing and, and open his treasure chest and then help Pooh. Uh, what's in here? A cosmic ray tremendously increases max AP. I might... Who do I want to give that to? Uh, let me see who I could give that to. Wait, I can't even equip on Donald or Goofy because they're not in the party right now. But, uh, yeah. Let's go talk to Pooh and help him get the... Get his head out the honey jar. So, is that you? Help? Alright, let's help him. Alright, the honey pot. Help Pooh out of the honey pot. Press triangle to stop the power gauge and begin swinging. Press triangle while swinging to choose the direction to send a pot flying. So, yeah, let's do that. I really love the song that plays for this. Wait, hold, did it? Wait, I, I messed it up. Wait, what? Okay, let's try that again. Great, so is that you? Help. All right, let's do that one more time. All right, let's... Okay, that should be good. Okay, there we go. That was yo. How did I fail that the first time? That was mad easy. I don't. I don't know. <sighs> Whatever. So, what were you doing here? I was thinking, perhaps there's a way to make it so you won't go away. You mean a way to make me stay? Yes. Would there be such a thing as a way to make it so you don't go away again? Pooh. Don't worry. I promise I'll come back and visit you now and then. Could you make it now and now instead? That seems a bit better to me. Sora, if I go looking for you, will I find you? I'll always be with you. Right here. You don't have to go anywhere. Just stay here, and you can see me anytime you want. You mean I just have to stay right here? Yep, that's all. Would you promise? Promise. I promise too. And so do Rue and I. We sure do. You're welcome to visit us anytime, Sora. Thanks. After all, I must tell you of my Uncle Albert's adventures at sea. Guess you'll be staying a while. <laughs> Goodbye, Sora. Thanks, Gopher. If you ever get lonely, just start bouncing and think of your pal, Tigger. I will, Tigger. You're leaving? Yes, I really have to go. Well, I won't be sad, because you'll always be right here, forever and ever. Right, Sora? And all of you are right here, too. See ya.
And with that, we get the best cure spell in the game, Curaga. So, yeah. And we also got an Auric Calcum. It's, it's a rare item, as you can see. And it's really good for synthesis. So, yeah, we're done with the 100 acre wood. I've always loved the conclusion for that world. Like, I just love how wholesome it is, man. Like, and just how sweet that ending is. I really do like, yo, I love the 100 acre wood. But yeah, I really did like that conclusion. So, with that done, we're going to go into Halloween Town. I might be able to complete it in this video. I'm not sure. There's nothing wrong with my design. It's flawless. There must be something wrong with the parts those imbeciles brought me. I need to find better assistance. We can have Jack Sparrow, Jack Sparrow, Jack Skellington in our party. So, yeah, let's go on to um, Christmas time. Oh! Wherever did you find these? In Halloween Town. You'll be needing them for Christmas, right, Sandy? Of course. But these are just a few of the Christmas presents that were stolen. Stolen? Oh, Sandy, you don't think it was me? Still wearing the outfit, I see. I just thought I'd dress for the occasion. But if you don't believe me, then we'll just have to find out who really did it. Very well, I'll leave it to you. All right, Sora, Donald, Goofy, we're off! Okay, so the Halloween Town theme, I think it's copyrighted, so I may have to mute that part of the video. I'm not too, I don't remember, but... Yeah, something is afoot in Santa's workshop, so we gonna see what's up with that. So let's go see what's up with that. Okay, yeah, we gotta go up here if I remember correctly. There's a puzzle piece right there. And it's a daylight puzzle piece. I might get the rest of the puzzle pieces just to show what the puzzle pieces make. I've never done it before. No! This looks good. No! Boring! This one? No! No way! Cow! So you three took them. Took what? You stole the presents, didn't you? It wasn't us. But... It really sounds like fun. Run, Run for it! it!
Okay, so we got a little mini boss on our hands. Because, you know, whenever a kid steals your stuff, the first thing to do is to fight them. Am I right? But, yeah, so how this works is that you got to damage them. And then um, once the health is down, you trap them in the box. It's that simple. I don't remember which kid is which, but I know the names are Lock, Shock, and Barrel. But, like I was saying, are you fuck? Right, here's hoping I don't die this time. Because that, that was really bullshit. But, yeah, like I said, the names is Lock, Shock, and Barrel. I don't remember which one is which. But I think the strategy is to, like defeat all of them and then trap them in the box but i think they come back after a certain amount of time after they defeated i don't remember but yeah so yeah that little motherfucker is down so wait where's the box at where's the box so yeah let's chop yo i yo oh my god no put him in the box no not whirligoof put him in the box okay that's one of them in the box two more to go yes i can see that game i know how to count Yo, I don't know what it is with fictional children getting on my nerves. Like, I really, yo, fictional children be mad annoying, bro. And yeah, I got, um, thing. Oh, I got another item slot and a bunch of other things. Where'd you put the presents? We told you we don't have them. Wow, so they just beat the shit out. They beat the shit out of a bunch of kids for nothing. Ain't that something? Yo, Kingdom Hearts 2 is canceled. Yo, I really wish niggas would try to cancel Kingdom Hearts 2. I'd be fucking heated. But yeah, because, you know, niggas cancel anything for everything. Or everything for anything, I mean. But yeah, anyways. Shoot, the dog has been working hard or something lately. But yeah, who would have thought these three little twerps are, were innocent? Okay, they said they're going to go back to Halloween Town. Probably to cause more trouble. Them kids look disgusting. So were those pranks responsible for taking the gifts? Surprisingly, no. Doesn't look like it. Then that means. Oh, there's Sally. What she got to say? Oh, thank goodness you're all here. Is something wrong? The Heartless are back in town square. I thought you should know. All right, good thing she let us know. So yeah, let's get out of here. Back to Halloween town like Donald said. But wait. Are you talking about the the gift napper? How how creative? The artists were playing with some presents when I saw them. Okay, so we have the culprits. So yeah, let's go in and get them. Bro, I swear to God, I hate. You you can't be here. Leave Halloween Town by order of the mayor. Somebody, anybody. I'm only an elected official. I can't handle this by myself. Sally was right. We've got to get the presents. Okay, so let's retrieve the presents and defeat these heartless. So yeah, let's get to it. Okay, you can tell which heartless has the <clears throat> has the present because they have a present icon over their head. So yeah, make sure you defeat the heartless and pick up the present. You know, I'm gonna go into master forms. I'm not trying to deal with these stupid fucking jack in the box heartless. No, 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 no. Yo, who would have seen that coming, bro? I swear to God, I knew that was going to happen. Okay, so OBS had no problem letting me know that I didn't have enough space on my computer to continue recording. So, yeah, that's why this, there was like a that last part ended really, it just ended abruptly like that. So, yeah, there's that. Okay, there's one present we got so far. We're a quarter of the way there. We're halfway there now. Are you fuck? Yo, I really don't know why I'm dying so much on the easy, the, yo. I'm dying on the easiest friggin' parts of the game, bro. Like, why? Okay, there we go. I got all the presents. That took way longer than it should have, yo. What a shame. It looks like it was such a nice present. Uh, Jack. Oh, help! Someone help me! My latest experiment is gone! It's been stolen! And we got the present. The present that was stolen. It is beautifully wrapped. I was just sitting here brainstorming, all of a sudden I was attacked. I think after this we fight like the boss and then we're done with this world, so if that's the case... I'm going to fight the boss and then end the video because this video is probably going to be really long. Like at this point, I'll probably record it for like almost an hour, but yeah.
The Heartless. Yeah, you're talking about the Heartless, how they probably stole his experiment. Oh, not the Heartless. So who could have stole his experiment then? Was it Oogie Boogie? No, it wasn't. Oogie Boogie is dead. We exterminated him. Get it? Because he's a bag of bugs and you and when you have bugs, you call an exterminator. Ha 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 ha. Aren't are not funny? No. Actually, I don't even know. I might have to, um... Yeah, I think I'm gonna end the video, honestly. Never mind. Or do I want to complete this world? Have you found a presence yet? Almost, Mr. Claus. Yo, I really... I really do not like the way Jack sa uh, says his name. That shit makes me fucking cringe, bro. Okay, use the factory to create presents. Actually, yeah, I might... I might just... I might just complete this world. Why not? Because I'm pretty much almost done with it anyway. All right, let me save. Let me revert. Do I have a drive recovery? I think I do. I don't have a drive recovery. That's that's tough. But yeah, let me just save the game real quick. Okay, yeah, so we got to talk to this ugly-ass elf right here and make presents. Gift wrapper. Use the cannon to shoot toys to the empty box. Press triangle to reload the cannon with toys. Okay, so, yeah, let's do this. I, I don't remember this part. If I remember, uh, lock, sh lock shock and barrel pull up. So, yeah. So, yeah, be on the lookout for those little dickheads. Okay, there we go. We completed it. That was easy. Really easy. Not quite. There's more? Don't worry. I'll take care of the rest. Did you finish making the presents? Yep, just waiting for Jack. So, uh, where do you think we ought to leave them? Hmm. Oh, I know a good spot. Whenever you're ready, just say the word. I'm back. This plaza should work well for your plan. Now, Jack, what is your plan? I've got it all figured out. You do? Of course. And I also have a wonderful idea. If we catch the thief for you, I would be honored to deliver the crew. And on that note, we'll be going. What are you doing? Let me go! Stop! Flip flop! It's not me, Donald. Patience, friends. Gorge, was that you? How come we have to be the bait? Good plan, eh? Ouch! Did it? Did I didn't mute, mute my mic? Okay, so now with that done, we gotta fight this fucking monstrosity right here. So yeah, let's hit him with the. Oh shit, I was gonna. Oh yeah, let's hit him with the whirl of goof. Um, I'm gonna probably replace Jack with with Donald, even though even though I'm probably gonna regret it. But yeah, no, stop juggling me, bro. You're not. This ain't Marvel versus Capcom three, bro. You ain't trying to hit me. You know you're not gonna hit me with no air combos, bro. Uh, let me go. Oh no, I was gonna go limit form. I almost went. I. Whoa, this game could really suck my dick. Are you serious, bro? Fucking Donald, son. Yo, you're mad useless, bro. Okay, so now I'm gonna have to just. Yo, imagine if I turn this into a drinking challenge where every time I died, I had to take a shot. I, I would fucking die. Like, yo, I would die from alcohol poisoning. Bro, I. You know what? Let me go and get some potions, bro. That's what I need to do. All right, please, bro. Cause I'm really fucking tired of dying over and over, bro. Like, this shit is gonna be. This shit is gonna be really tight right now. All right, let me swap out. Oh, my. 
Yo, it's really crazy because Halloween Town is my favorite world in this game, and here I am struggling on this stupid ass boss, bro. Yo, even though fucking critical, not critical. Even though normal mode, this boss is really is, is really annoying. Like, come on, come on, come on. I can I can beat this. I can win this fight. 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 Come on, please, please. I'm really tired of this fucking boss. Wait, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! Yes! Oh my god, finally, bro! Oh my goodness, bro. Jesus Christ, that took way longer than it should have, man. My god. We did it! The mystery is solved! Did you catch the thief? Naturally. I just can't figure out why the doctor's experiment would go around stealing Christmas presents. His experiment? The thief. It was a moving puppet made by Dr. Finkelstein. Hmm, the doctor's made a moving puppet. I see. He is always tinkering with things. Now listen, Jack. I'd like to thank you, and while delivering presents is something only I can do, I can give you an idea of what it's like. Sandy Claus? Yes, all that poor puppet wanted was a heart. Ho, ho, ho! And with that, we get one of the best Keyblades in the game, the Decisive Pumpkin. The greater number of combos landed, the more damage is dealt, leading to a strong finishing move. Yeah, this Keyblade is really, really good. Interesting. So, the puppet wasn't stolen after all. It ran away on its own. In other words, my experiment was an overwhelming success. Santa Claus thinks maybe it left because it was trying to find a heart. That's quite possible. Unlike my Sally, it wasn't equipped with a heart. But if it wanted a heart, why was it going around stealing all those Christmas presents? Maybe because presents are a way to give your heart to someone special. Hmm. When you put it that way, I feel sort of bad for it. I don't understand. There's no box. No ribbon tied in a bow. Jack, it's not about the box or the ribbons. It's about what's inside the box. No, Sora. What really counts, what's really special, is the act of giving the gift to wish deep in your heart to make someone else happy. Right. Of course. Thank you, Sally. You're absolutely right. Wait. What's this? I feel so strange. So very happy. Jack, that must be Sally's present. Really? This wonderful feeling? Oh, Sally. You've given me the nicest present in the world. And I've nothing to give you in return. What would you like? Just name it. Absolutely anything. The nicest present I could ever ask for, Jack is just to be with you. You don't even have to ask for that. Oh! Uh. Maybe I never gave her a real present after all. Oh, I bet Kyrie would like most anything you gave her. I know. That's what made it so hard to decide. It's not your gift, it's what's in your heart. My heart? You bet. Tell me that, Sally. How? Well, as long as she can be with you, what else does she need?
And with that done, we don't got to worry about that stupid ass Dr. Finkelstein and his bitch ass experiments no more. And oh, see that area right there? That right there is the final area in the game. But I don't think we can access it now. I think we got to um, do a couple more things before we do that. So yeah, we have two more Disney worlds to go. And as you can see, there's a gummy ship route in front of Twilight Town. But yeah, Chip just said that he he saw um another Twilight Town. So yeah, there's some trouble going on around Twilight Town. So in the next video, we're going to finish up Pride Lands. Then I think we can go back to um Space Paranoids, I believe. I don't know for sure. But yeah, we're going to go to... um. Pride Lands, and then Twilight Town and all that, probably. And then we're going to go into the final area in the game. So, yeah, I'm going to call it a night and this video right here. Part 24, Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix on Critical Mode. Thank y'all so, so much for watching. It really, truly does mean a lot, and I love the support that y'all be showing me. For real. But, yeah, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on post notifications and follow my socials that are in the description down below. And I'm going to be off this. Y'all take care, have a good one, and I will see y'all in the next video.